Hi, once again, uh, for Arthur, for the love of cars, this is episode two in our series where we try and interpret the Traffic and Road Safety Act, CAP 361. Now, this, like I said last time, this is the Traffic and Road Safety Act of 1998, and it has amendments uh, from 2020, 2022, and 2023. Those amendments exist in this particular publication. Uh, and today, we are going to look at... Uh, Use of motor vehicles. This is part. F this is part six, and we are looking at uh, the section one hundred and seven. Yeah, we are looking at uh, one hundred and seven, and this says uh, the condition of motor vehicle etc for use on the road. Now we're going to be talking about uh, the condition of uh, the motor vehicle you decided to use, and uh, of course what fines come in case the condition of the motor vehicle you want to use or you plan to use, uh, the condition is not good, what happens? And uh, so we start with uh, part one of this section or provision one. Uh, remember, we're going to be reading one by one and I'll give you my interpretation. My interpretation just that doesn't have to be uh, the interpretation of the person that wrote here, but we need to interpret the laws, right? Do you know that again? They have told you time and again that ignorance of the law does not make you innocent. So, so anyway, uh, provision one says that this is a, a part, this is part six use of motor vehicles, and uh, this is uh, must be section 107 condition of motor vehicle for use on the road yeah and uh let's start with uh provision one uh, no motor vehicle trailer or engineering plant shall be used on a road unless the motor vehicle trailer or engineering plant and all its parts and equipment including tires and lights, are in good repair and in efficient working order and are in such conditions that the driving of the vehicle on the road either in daytime or at night is not likely to be danger, a danger to the persons traveling on the motor vehicle, trailer or engineering plant or to other road users. Now, there, 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 there are some keywords I want us to note in this provision. One, that a motor vehicle needs to have equipment. The equipment that work with that car, they need to be in perfect, in good, no, 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 in good repair. Good repair, that's the first keyword, repair. Then, efficient working order. Okay? Good repair, efficient working order. Now, this is my interpretation. You can have a light on your car it's lighting but as long as the officer can deem that this light is not actually not lighting properly that vehicle should not be on the road that's why it's the officer officer to say that okay your your, your motor vehicle is not in good working condition all the equipment that come with the car now which equipment come with the car again number two one every car has two a pair of headlamps a pair of parking lights in front, a pair of indicators, a pair of wipers and wiper fluid. Some cars even have wiper fluid and one, one wiper in the rear. Now at the rear, it has a pair of parking lights. It has a pair of indicators. It has a pair of reverse lights. All those things are supposed to be working, right? Then it, a, a normal car has four tires. Okay, now we all know a car, a, a car tire without tread will be slippery. It won't work it the way it's supposed to work. Um, and this very car has four windows. Amadiri Sagariana, four. So they have to go up and come down. Go up and come down. All the four. Of course, there are, there are those cars that have two. And in your logbook, it shows. So we're in Murukai in Amadiri Sagariana. Chitekes are both the, are supposed to go up and down. Okay, then every car has an engine which is supposed to be working properly. Every car has a fuel tank where you put fuel for the car to run. Now, if the engine doesn't run for some reason, your car is not safe for the road. 
Bine moroka bie basika koko kubo. Musirikali wa dembo gambe ni moroka. Egende parking. E kusika ketia. Tonja gamba why? If a car has a fuel tank. How do you start to say that a moroka wede mwa mafutanga. Ativa ajiwa fuel tank. I don't know if you get what I'm saying. Ha? Huh? Mbuwa muka guku wede kwa mkubo. Guku guwa kukutia mkubo. Wachisegira. That car is not safe for the road. A motor ke yabiso mpira. A traffic officer has the right to get your car. Na aji sika kubrek down na aji sika kubrek. Because it's not safe for other road users. Chemva muda bantu yabimuro ke yabimu mjia kukubo. Nechifira kukubo. Aba neba bitu omeda neba fa. We've seen so many instances. There's an instance where a family. Wabu msa jari afu karafu. Family yoyo nani guawo. Ochekira, we don't want that to happen to our people. So, your car has to be safe. And David Ramos on Nazibenga Zambuka, because he's Okubanga Tezambuka, and Tezika, and Kuba Neva Kuba, that do never Kuba Nemufa. Oba, she's Okuba. It's too hot, the windows don't go down, and people can't breathe, and they die. Ochekira, wipers may not be working. Of course, and then it rains, and then you guys can't see. Air conditioning system. Okuja Konga, your car does not come with AC. Yo, AC! <laughs> if your AC doesn't work and your car comes with AC, when it's raining, when you guys are breathing, uh, then you can clean the windows with that air. I don't know if I make sense. But everything which into a chijiram, ne ready your kubanga take on office or dembo gambo is okwebo one not made ah. Then there are these other things that probably most of you guys don't even know. Every car comes with uh, Bazita flares. If you go in emergency, you can light that thing, it goes in the air to alert people that, oh, I have any, I need help here. Then every car must have a fire extinguisher. Because those things should be in the car. What if it, it don't make it dangerous for other people? It should have an emergency kit. Take it, Kesendo Oza. So a traffic officer has the right to say why you got to So let's go to section two. No provision two of section one zero seven. Aha. No motor vehicle, trailer or engineering plant shall be used on a road with a load greater than the load capacity declared by the manufacturers of the chassis of the vehicle, trailer, or engineering plant, or the capacity determined by a vehicle inspector under section 13. Now, uh, there are these guys above the trailer. You guys go and modify your chassis. Sometimes chassis chases. Manchester United. Anyway, so, if in your logbook, the car says you're in a cotique Never kukua tango oti setani bidi. You're not, you're breaking the law. And I know lorry drivers, wangi wangi na nema tike moroka, na ajitika taktani, moroka ina kubaya tani satu, na ajitika tani kumi, wanasekata wa yere ngamba, haye moroka, ante ina kubatika tani satu, na ye, tujitika muenda, ezi tuwala, ezi tuwala, ingi nite wanga, na ye, ezi tuwala. <laughs> Omenya mateka. So anyway, uh, to get the provision number three of the of this, uh, uh, no, no, mat, no motor vehicle, trailer, or engineering plant shall be used on a road if the distribution, parking, and adjustment of the load is such as to make it danger a danger to a persons to persons traveling on the motor vehicle, trailer, or engineering plant or other road users. Kakati, ka section ka second ka provision to kagambie. Emoro kwa wewe tika tani ya mchitu ndo tika tani ya mchitu ndo katika toto ya kudira o kule bintu abi tika kule bintu tika kubia gaga levit oroko ba tena bintu 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 wewe tani ya mchitu ndo gambi eh eh ba tu gamba kutika tani ya mchitu ndo bintu 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 tani tano bia gaga le ba na ba ya walowa ba ya ba tika bintu na tiko mudo guembuzi ne guita ke ne guita ke no ngambo tu fa ajia kuvuga atume aba boda. Bananga, you boda boda guys. Muti, uwa bodo ti kacha mabati. Kati tukanya you people want money. Eh? O ti kama bati nga banabe baku vida, banabe baku vida. That, obo menya mateka, ilo wa traffic. Wadembo kukwa ata na haku galida. Wadembo kukwa ata na haku haki nge pichiyo. Eh? No sangu msaja wa boda atisi jine miti jino jetu seleke sa. Bajita buliti. Nekali tuunsi. O ti kakali tuunsi yu. Vero. The Ruha said, O Menya Mateka. Section, uh, Bajita, eh, Zinoziba subsection, Teziba provision, Ziba subsection, section 10, 
7 tuli musitukoze subsection 1 subsection 2 subsection 3 <laughs> anange njiga bige we muroza mbunzi nagena ne soma mate uraba asoma mate kate baga basomesa munde keze mbasomesa so tugeze mu subsection 4 egamba for the purpose of subsections 2 eri yagament totika more than the load prescribed by the manufacturer ne subsection 3 which says that totika byagaga de Persons traveling on a motor vehicle, trader, or engineering plan shall be taken to be part of the load, except according to the law, kankubulire buli muntu ali mmorokoyo ah is part of the road chinegeza baba bapima mwabage genyo ate muvuga trailer bwe baba bapima ina kuste mudduka nga mumba laba mmanyo kudduka munga mugenze ku webridge ino sigalamu nawe ne bakupimira ko bagambi abantu lokaba takirizibwa ku abata pimibwa nga nga road ku morokeyo one a child who is under the apparent age of 5 years and who does not occupy a seat shall not be taken to be a passenger Omano omuto akawa suwe miyake etano. Ngelata tutte muto. Ngabasi tutte musitule. Any two children, each of whom is over the apparent age of five years and under the age of 12. Awana babidi ngatepaweza miyaka kumi nebidi. Ngababa basuka miyake etano. Aba muto omu. Chite giza sengo tambula. Kurole yunga obawe mumoto kayunga. Muni mwaba abana babidi. Ngaba miyaka kumi nebidi. Ngatepaweza kumi nebidi baso ketano. Uyaba muto. Tujia kuata abana mukaga. Abasuke aba, aba miyake etano. Eh? Ngatepaweza kumi nebidi. Yoga ya fanda atete kari ajida. Ntege reke sendo uza. Chite geza. Bwemba mumoto ka. Eh? Bwemba mumoto ka. Omano mutata naweza miyake etano. Tepa mubala nga, nga lodi. Ochite gede. Na ye. Abana babili abasuke suke miyake etanu. Kate manuweza kumi nebili o yaba muntu omu. Chite geza abasa buro kwele da. Tegele kese. Ya <laughs> mateka gawoma. In the case of a vehicle licensed under section 94. Yo 94 tuja jiso moru lala. Njibu uka intentional because nziza ye mabigateje sagi nda. Kati namu mgurobu tabu. Kastamba wade koche mba wade. Tuja kutunja kulaba ye in the future. Kari. Let's go to uh, subsection 5. Any person who uses who uses on a road, a motor vehicle, trailer, or engineering plant in contravention of section 123. The vehicle should be in good condition. Two, it should not load overload. Three, it should not over... <laughs> commits an offense and is liable on conviction of a fine not less than 15 currency points and not exceeding 60 points currency points or imprisonment of not less than six months and not exceeding two years or both now subsection five of section 107 <laughs> well, you know, you know, you know. subsection five of section 107 one if you overload your vehicle two if you make your vehicle cover, carry things that are bigger than what it's supposed to carry. Three, if you put a lot of things in the corner and putting their life in danger, you can be fined. Bagambe 15 currency point. I told you last time uh, that every currency point is equal to 20,000 20, shillings. So if they are finding you 15 currency points, it means a chipapuracha overloading. Chitani Kurukumtuarameka. I don't know what, what it says but according to the law, it's supposed to be not less than 15 currency points, which is 300,000, and not more than 60 currency points. Now, when you occupy regulation, you choose some one on go, police, I need to publish a Cuba, and you're quoting a Nature Cuba, cutting a bino. The Novavu Queram quoting a real traffic, a sort of by each public chairman, and whereas a cuminator, no, or a sort of cut to Alaka, a HCK, Mubanguangua, no, which again, what are your provisions? So, the Neteka, the better regulations are Teddy Yamba, Catuva Gamanti, buying Okujira sixty currency points. That's one million two hundred thousand shillings. You continue overloading. Between 300,000 to 1.2. Or, bagena kusibe miezi mukaga, kumiake ebidi, six months. Do you know what it means to be locked up for six months? 
Mkugambi bage na kusibe miaka muka, e miezi mukago Oveo nga no mtu ya kusingo obu siru wa kusingo obu gaga Zimbabu lida So be careful So Tugenza mu subsection 6 e gamba For the purposes of subsection 5 I know law you listen to the terms I'm using. Eh? Subsection, section, eh, for the purposes. <laughs> In the case of a contravision of section one, where you overload, any person who is shown to the satisfaction of the court to have been responsible for the maintenance of the motor vehicle trader or engineering plant. Eh? Orida. Kagamba. Subsection one, Yagambi. The car should be in good condition. But in subsection 6, they are saying, before they lock up anyone, if a police officer, or if your driver, if your driver, <laughs> if your driver says, my lord, I'm not responsible. Me, I'm just a driver. Bring my boss. He refused to buy tires. He refused to buy the, the, the bulb. And you, the boss, you are presented to the court as responsible, but you did not take it. take it? Nimagamba, and in the case of contribution of sec subsection 2 or 3, any person who is shown to the satisfaction of the court to have been responsible for the loading of the motor vehicle, trailer, or engineering plan, Kakati, Kankamario, shall be taken to have committed the like offense and is liable to co on conviction of the same penalties. But driver, Mumpuli, is a Abafu ke morukaza abaka maba mwe. Tulimu section 107 of the Traffic and Road Safety Act 1998. E gambi. Subsection 1 ya gambi. Moruke inakuba mumbeira nuji. Subsection 2 na ya gamba you don't overload. Subsection 3 na ya gamba tote kambi ito bi soka. Saizi ya motoka. Kainchuki na subsection 5 na ya gamba. Badja kufa ininga between ya mituwala asatu. Kumidi yoni ya mune ya mituwala ameka. No kusibe mieze mokaga. Kumiaka. Ebidi, obavi o na ba inzoku katuwe milioni mne mtu arabi tukusibu ni miaka <laughs> ni miaka ebidi na ene baka mu subsection six oudi da mu subsection six nti sengo sawa kuleta yao mtu no gamba ba yemu sonyi we yemu roke yemu mumbera ambina esi buvuna nizibu abu ange manager ba mu buvuna nizibu arabi dire mtu kaya na senta ariandi we know it of nice, no, no, there will be driver, driver, it up, eh, it answer. Mukumu, bampa, Google, bampa, Manager, uno, bamu, Google, 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 Go sobra of proving and see go at your audience and look up a banang, Morocans and Vuga Vuga, Mukama Wangi, a Jova Rodis, and Namugambi and a co. No let over Judas in the Sigue Baba Sibamwe, Binaeva Musiba Mugende, Yoba Bidi. Bakama Bamu Bajakuiga Bajakuiga, carry to get subsection seven. Where a person is convicted of an offense under sub subsection one, poor condition, subsection two and three overloading and overloading. <laughs> in respect of the same motor vehicle, two or more times within 12 months, the court may order the chief licensing officer to suspend the license of the vehicle, trailer, or engineering plant issued under section 17 for six months. Kakati, if they get your car in poor condition for more than one time, chita is never kube papura. If you poor condition, emirundi ebidi, oba never kwatanga you overloading more than once. But then, but we just number plate. Never sit to order. Never go. But we don't come back to Senga moroka ya baji kuata. DMC more than two times number plate. But then, but we just kuata. Ane kadi baji kujiko aga. Saja iti. Never kuata ga yo overloading more than two times. Ah ah. But then, but we just number plate. Never says. Biri wano ba na ang. Sibi kambo sibi ang. Ang ngaya 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 Subsection what? Eight. The owner of the motor vehicle, trailer, or engineering plant, the license in relation to which is ordered to be suspended under subsection seven, shall return the license and the registration plates of the motor vehicle, trailer, or engineering plant to the chief licensing officer, who shall return the license and registration plates or issue another license and registration after the, the expiration. Kwa ba, licenses, 
na ye akosegera kama le bigambo biti oba ne abiwani kabino eh ye kabali bali kuba mu pibedda be bawani kokwa ne bigambo binji of course bajja kugamba ntibi no mugaso kambi some some kagan come kagamba expiration of the period of suspension on production of the applicant cut eh mbadde mbusa ekitwe kiziportant amataika wanono we gatkwatira ulira kankadde muko naka sub section 8 the owner of the motor vehicle trailer or engineering plant the license in relation to which is ordered to be suspended under subsection 7 jukira tukambi overloading amoroka bembera mbe bibiri baje baso rutwara license kati gwe nanyi nibyo obizaye wa licensing officer eh kati licensing officer nabi kudizanga license we ba ko bachita bise Bagamenti after the suspension period which is six months is is has expired the licensing officer will return the licensing the plates and license back to you after you have produ produced eh, the vehicle inspector certificate stating that the vehicle is fit in all respects for the use on the road kitegeza senge muruko ebaji kwa tange ddm cm mirundi ebiri mwaka gumu ne batwala number plate zo Muchi wira mwe bajja ko number plate ne muloza ba folder ba police yako ze sibi tufu oina okudde bajja ya jisa bajja ya jisa spending ando 6 months chitegeza after the 6 months when it expires you go back to the licensing officer present a report from the vehicles inspector go twitter i of v ke mono kakati baji kebe de mumbera nunji licensing officer na kudiza license yo ne number plate amateka gawoma tugenem sub section 9 When a motor vehicle, trailer or engineering plant license has been suspended under subsection 7, no refund of license fees shall be made. Ako tsoke tukareke kare kakaina kakajira ko. Subsection 10. A court shall in sentencing any person under subsection 5 in addition to any other penalty which may impose order the chief licensing officer to suspend the license of the vehicle issued under sub under section 17 for a period not exceeding 2 years kadi no try waga a license baji twala for 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 6 months a court a case book suspending a license here for 2 years of course the court can't exceed 2 years yet to gendo mura mura muzina na na ajira na na suspending a license here for 3 years oli wadde nga nyabo mura muzi ah yakuba mwenigo Mwefura ba manya mateka atha ya tugaba abuze atha ya ni mu justice system gamu munai wa for the love of cars ayinta ataputa mateka ge moto kaya tugamba nyabo mulamuzi tokirizi wa kutwara license plates za fe kusika miyake ebiri you can suspend it but for only two years in kukirizo mulamuzi suspending for two years nebo geza no suke miyase miyake ebiri sebo mulamuzi nkulope wa atha <laughs> kale tugenda ku sub section 11 ne gamba Where an order is made in respect of the vehicle under subsection 10 the owner of the vehicle shall return the license and registration plate of the vehicle to the chief licensing officer and the operator's vehicle license issued under to the secret secretary of the board byonanga we babi kuwa simanya logo buku simanya bichi byono bizayo katiteka lino chitetete ka into account chiri nti enaku zino logo buku sibutabu logo buku zana ku zuri ku tinza fe we login we see the logo buku we login kati sikitegedde chibagamba oba bagenda mutinyo nayo ne babijja nga process ba mpamvu ebya dabe abanga byangu ngo ogira ogira nga leta logo buku ole tinana ba plating ne kale nda kusuna number plate tuzi kwata logo buku tuzi kwata ko anyway omulimo gwango lwali gwa kugamba teko litegere the chief license tugenda kasemba yo ka sub section 12 the chief licensing officer shall return the license and the registration plates in respect of the vehicle after the expiration of the suspension and on production of the applicant of a vehicle's ins inspe vehicle inspector certificate that the motor vehicle is in fit in all aspects etekali ali dio ndigani katika amba summarizing the tekali no tubadde mu section 111 eh yebai say use of motor vehicles washtegede katuba dem section 111 toko za sub section ebo na nyina mwaka ntuka muke nabo se ka part C of sub section 4 kuna kabuse because kaina je kantu ali wa wangu atesa so mama teka kuna kabuse tujja kaka baringo lala na ye tubade togera ku condition of the motor vehicle etc for use on the road ne bakugamba they have told you under this section that your motor vehicle should be in good condition everything that came with the car to work should be able to work Okay if it doesn't work you break the law then they also told us that 
Your motor vehicle should not be overloaded or should not be loaded beyond what the manufacturer prescribed. If the car should load one ton, load one ton, not 1.5. If you do so, you break the load. Never gamba. If your car is stray, loads to this capacity. Don't load like this. If you do so, you're breaking the law. We say that you want to have a memory for this. But also under that, I'm thinking Muno Muno Muteka Muno, Munimu provision, a Kugamba will modify a chassio, the Ewa IOV, a young Grima Gaikati Katani Wazit. Is that a young Gamba? Never Kugamba, but many of you, but call every interview. You can be fined, you can be in prison. Chitageza. Nena te biyongavicha haria, nene te kari ngendo kuno njia tu gano kumenye mito fa ba fugaze fielder, but ubuli zedwaachi. Ede te kanga nda dinonya, but for now that's it for today. I look forward to seeing you uh, next week in the two episodes. I'll be doing two episodes of this lo until ngatuli mazeyo. I'll be doing two episodes interpreting whatever we can interpret so that te bad damu tukwatia on the wrong side of the law. I also advise wobo sobola you go and buy the publication of the Traffic and Road Safety Act. Hey, it, it, of course, you make sure that it has the amend, amendments of 2020, 2022, 2023, so that you have it with you on, on uh, when you're driving. Jaya pamiti jaya ne teko teko dashboard. Jaya teka ori ori mula goti no teka ku dashboard. No ori oko jaya pamiti no ji mula gabo anadi da babu ati jaga bo no simu yebe o no simu yebe o chida gede jaya teka na kata wogero kagurebe na kumuro kodi sewari. Kali, I'll see you next week. Don't forget our daily broadcasts. Don't forget us, our weekend broadcasts. And don't forget that I do pre-purchase inspection. If you're going to buy a car, I come with a mechanic. And we make sure you get a good car. We make sure you get a car at a good price. We make sure that there is no compromise in the entire buying process of your next or your first car. Don't forget to check me out. Ciao.